What's up guys? Man, that's bright as crap. Let me change this. What's up guys? My name is Denny Chow. Thank you for checking out my channel. And today I want to do something a little bit different with my videos. Usually I do videos on stocks or my Asian men, black women vlogs or vlogs with my son. And today I just want to do a video on some of my exercise routine and what really helped me transform my body into just uh, into more shredded. So I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys are into working out, uh, trying to do the shape, who doesn't want to look good, feel healthy, feel athletic. While you're getting older, it's important to take care of your body, right? And so some of the things that I've been doing is that I always knew that as I'm getting older, I'll stop lifting so heavy weights and I'll move into more cardio and more, um, you know, calisthenics. And so one thing that I've been doing is I've been focusing on my cardio, but one thing about the cardio is that if you do too much cardio, it kind of loses some of your muscle masses, right? And so you don't want that. You're still, as a man, at least for me, I still want to obtain a good body mass, but losing body fat and still doing cardio. And I got the perfect thing that I started doing about a year ago that completely changed the way I think about cardio and how I do it and you wanna know what it is. So you may be thinking about the gymnasium that's behind me, but really that's not it, I'm just here at the park. So only two things that you really need, well three things you really need, is an open space somewhere in your backyard if you have a big space or at a park, or somewhere in an open space with grass. Uh, it's gonna be better for your knees and everything. And then you're gonna need some cones. You can get these flat ones or you can get these bigger stand-up cones, I use both of them. That's what I bought and so that's what I've used. And some football cleats or some baseball cleats or something on the bottom to help you accelerate. And of course you don't actually need these or you don't actually need cones. You can find uh, things to improvise but that's what I use. Eyes in the sky, gazing far into the night, I raise my hand. Alright guys, so I'm here at the field now. I just put my cleats on. Um, just talked about the field, the atmosphere that I'm in so you can get, get an idea. This is behind of an elementary school right by the house. Uh, I think I'm supposed to be here. There's no school right now. It's still summertime. Um, I'm getting ready to go to Vegas to visit my parents in a couple of days. And so I'm uh, hanging out, uh, just relaxing. Finished my summer semester. Did great. Thank you for all the support, guys. Still maintaining a decent amount of muscle mass uh, while still shredding. This allows you, when you sprint, let me just show you right here. I can kind of see it. When you when you just jog, right? So you did this little jog motion. But when you sprint, look at the muscles that it takes. I'm probably about 175 right now. I did get to 165 at one point thinking that that's what I needed. But all it did was give me kind of what they call skinny fat. I was still kind of decently uh, big up here, but as far as like mass wise, I was just drastically losing it just because I was uh, getting into cardio and then dieting so much. But anyways, we'll get right into the workout. Again, this is uh, what really changed it for me is sprinting, but not just sprinting straight, but being able to be um, having agility, being able to be athletic, to have explosion. And so what I do is I set up the cones behind me, which I'm gonna show you in a minute, and I'll walk you through it. Um, I set up the cones and I just pretend like I'm playing football all over again back in high school, where I'm working on my explosion. I, I, I sprint as fast and as hard as I can, catch the ball, jog back, give myself 30 seconds to about a minute to rest up, and then go with that again. About 30 to 45 minutes is all you need for this workout. And you can do this in the winter time. It's much better in the summertime, but you still can be a beast and do it in the winter time if you want. And it is, has ultimately changed the way my body looks and changed um, how I do cardio. It's fun, it's fast, takes about 45 minutes and you're done. 
into the fire But it's no use Cause you can't stop it from shining through Alright guys, if you're wondering how I'm setting these up All I'm doing is doing 5 yards uh, Sometimes I do 10, but right now just to start up And you can always switch these up And so what I did is uh, I'll show you right here So from here, 5 yards, 5 yards, 5 yards, 5 yards So it's 5, 10, 15 All right, so that's the first drill and that's on the right side. And so what it is, is if you look at the replay on it, <clears throat> what it is on the replay of it, is that you have a receiver in front of you and what you're doing is you're just faking and then you run. And then once you get to it, that other cone, you cut to the left and then run straight out. And so what that does is gonna work on not just your initial explosion, it works on your footwork at the same time, it's gonna allow you to accelerate and different levels as you're cutting to the right you have to slow back to the left and so this is not only helping you with your cardio but it's really helping you be more athletic helps you to be able to move some of the muscles that you wouldn't move if you're just running straight you know you can jog all day and it's good don't don't get me wrong but um, the cement's not really good for your knees while you're out here on the grass you don't have to do cleats but cleats is gonna allow you just to push and the harder you push, even though you're running longer, maybe an hour or so, you're exerting a lot more energy in a shorter amount of time when you're out here sprinting. And you're moving left and right, and you're allowing yourself to use these little muscles throughout your body that you wouldn't use if you're just running straight or sprinting straight. And so let's get into the second uh, uh, routine, which is just another route. I'm giving you guys ideas. You can do your own thing, but this is really what helps you. I'm not I'm tired but I'm not really like exhausted I feel good it's like 98 degrees out here so it's kind of hot um, I should have just guess I should have just filmed this in the morning time but anyways so here's the second drill the first one was cut right up and now let's look at, look at the other one So that one was a little bit different. That one, you're coming off again. There's like three, four ways you can come off of the cornerback, right? You can just kick right and fake left. You can shuffle your legs and then go. Uh, you can just bounce up and then slide. There's all different kind of ways, but you get the point. Uh, so anyways, so you cut off, you run left like you did on the original one, but this time you wrap around the other cone with fast feet and you shuffle. And once you go past that point, you come back, catch the ball, and then sprint up. That one, again, is gonna work with your acceleration, it's gonna work with your cardio because you have to do that 15 yard dash at the end. That's why I set up the cones at the end. All right guys, so that was the video and I just wanted to do this quick workout because the things that are progressing in my life and I wanna share it with you guys, hopefully this guys should help you out. The guys that are on the plateau and trying to look for that next level, Really try this out, man. I mean, what's there to lose? You go to the gym every day, you bust your ass, it's time to see results. Minus the dieting, this right here is a great cardio workout. I still lift weights, but I have lowered that down. I used to lift weights about four times a week and do cardio once. Now I'm lifting weights about two times a week, and I do cardio about two, three times a week. And so now the results are different. Um, I'll do another video on how I've been gaining math uh, and you know, I'm not a personal trainer I'm not no af Athletic crazy dude that's on some NFL or anything I'm just a regular guy with a regular job going to college, you know have a busy life But I still can throw in these workouts because I understand how important health is and again without consistencies without diet and good You're not gonna be able to get the body that you want uh, every day I wake up, I feel good, I'm confident, and I put in the work to get to that point. 
And you know, I have a lot more to grow, a lot more to learn, not just the physical aspect, but just uh, spiritually, mentally, and as a person, just to be a better person than I was yesterday, every single day. And brick by brick, you eventually build your wall. So thank you for watching my video, guys. P please leave a thumbs up if you guys enjoyed this. Leave comments below if you wanna see more videos about working out. Uh, if you wanna see other videos, let me know. I'd be more than happy to make them for you. And I'll catch you guys next time. I want to welcome you to my channel and again if you haven't click that subscribe button on the bottom and you can follow me click that bell then you get the notification whenever time I upload videos and I like to thank you and welcome to my channel If you will tell me I'm the only one that you love Life could be a dream, sweetheart Hello